A fuelless come and go store in downtown Des Moines is closing. Maverick, the new owner, says it no longer fits in its long term plans for Des Moines. KCCI's Marcus McIntosh is asking if this is a telling trend for downtown businesses. Marcus. Ben and Stacy, the urban walk up come and go on 7th Street behind me will close after business on March 24th. But city officials tell me that it will not put much of a dent in development plans for downtown Des Moines. Whether you call this urban walk up come and go a failure or an idea that did not take, come and go corporate owner Maverick says it is concentrating on what has proven to work. Sending us this statement that reads in part, we'll continue to focus our efforts on locations that best serve our customers with fuel, delicious food, great service, and a clean and welcoming environment. We spoke with a Des Moines City official who says, big picture, Maverick closing the downtown fuel is come and go, Walgreens closing up shop on Walnut, and Hy-Vee condensing its downtown hours does not mean trouble is in the air for downtown development. It's nothing to panic about. Um, we still have tens of millions of dollars, if not hundreds of millions of dollars of development going on on both sides of the river. We're still moving forward. A downtown resident may disagree. He says businesses shutting down closes his options. Hy-Vee changing to, to lesser hours was definitely a big problem down here. Closing at 6, um, especially if you work out of town or something, is, is a problem. The Walgreens shutting down makes these types of places more important. Des Moines Deputy City Manager asks for patience because development is not a sprint, it is a marathon. We think in terms of decades, not in terms of years when we look at downtown development. So what you're seeing now is pretty typical. You go through peaks and troughs in development. Now, Anderson hinted that big things coming to downtown Des Moines. An announcement could be made on that in the next 30 to 60 days. As for the come and go building, Maverick says they will fulfill their lease. They'll repurpose the building and use it for training. We're live in downtown Des Moines. I'm Marcus McIntosh, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's news leader.